Good afternoon, good evening. This is Dragonfly Gamer UK, and we are in Valheim Ashlands. I've started a new game with a new character and a new world. Um, I have modified the world slightly, I've increased the resource rate from 1 to 1.5, and I have reduced or well, changed the portal setting to allow us to go through the portal with halls. In uh, default, you're not going to be able to go through with all, but I think it's a bit pointless because you run through with all your battle armor and you know battle weapons and things. So why can't you go with through with battle armor? It's be ridiculous. I know that's how they want the game to be played, and it is. It will detract from the game, but it's my game. It's the way I want to play it. So we have literally just landed. And where's little birdie gone? There he is. Let's have a chat with him. Welcome to the tenth world, warrior. I am Huggin, sent here to guide you in your travels. The megaliths surrounding you are the sacrificial stones. They represent the Forsaken, which you must slay in order to send, ascend to Valhalla. Ooh, where's he gone? Right, come on, I know you're going to come back. There you go. This stone is a vague viscer. These magical stones were scattered throughout the lands by own as signposts pointing towards the ritual grounds of the Forsaken. If inspected closer, this one will reveal the summoning place of Aethir, your first prey. He's a mighty beast, so you need to properly arm yourself before even attempting to defeat him. And I still can't speak. So, let's look at this. We are here. He's up there. Let's, oh, there's a bit of water there. Might be to get moved by water. I could do with finding some water. We came in that way, obviously. I want to find somewhere close to water to build. So, let's just come out the map, right, and start collecting things, and as you pick things up, if you can use them, uh, you get the recipes coming up on the left hand side, so first thing I want to be able to do is build a club, uh, can I build a club yet, no, what do I need for a club, I need more wood, oh he's back again, that's a bird by the way coming back, Hagen or whatever his name is, there he is, yeah, Take stock of your inventory. Most items must be crafted. However, due to your recent departure from Midgard, you will have to recall the true shape of objects. Just pick things up and it will come back to you, I'm sure. My lesser brother, Munin, tells me you can fashion a stone axe out of wooden stone. I'd, oh, berries. Want berries. It's going to tell me about food now, I think. Okay, let's just, just tear him out. Go on. A tasty morsel. We have found a snack. Consume it to improve your health and stamina. Be aware that before long you will grow hungry again. So try to always have at least a couple of different meals ready. Um, so you've got three stomachs currently. And they're mushrooms there. I saw them so I thought I'd pick them up. I'm just looking for some more sticks. That easy to pick up. Oh, like this. Sorry, I thought that was a skeleton mound then. Um, so now I should be able to craft a club. Uh, you can go there. That was a deer by the sound of it. You can go there. Um, is he gone, is he? Yeah, he's gone. So we need to start collecting things. So first things first, I know I'm using a club. On a small tree, but I get some sap and I get some wood from it. And there's something in there. Ooh, is that amber? Amber? Well, you don't normally get that so early in the game. What else is there? Is that a chest or...? Yeah, it looks like it. Okay. Oh! Or... Oh. Let's just get out in the open a bit. I've got a boar and a grayling coming after me. The grayling will be fairly easy to take care of. Yeah, there he goes. Say hello to Colin. Oh, another one. You want to say hello to Colin too, do you? Come here. There we go. Alright, where's that boar? They normally come back and attack you again. We do obviously deciding not to. Oh, here he comes. Got him. 
The wet things die, they explode like that, and they drop things. So he's dropped meat and leather scraps. The uh, graylings drop wood and um, tree sap. Okay. Okay, so let's just take stuff where we are. We need to eat some food, so we'll eat one of them, and we'll eat one of them. I took two stomachs of the three. I can't eat raw meat. No good for me, but that has increased my health and my stamina. Next thing to do is try and find a location to start building. Now I can see over here it looks fairly flat and open, but I need it to be sort of close to water. Let's just have a quick look here. Oh, um, you find structures everywhere like this on this game. I'm not sure there's anything in the middle of these ones. You get ones that look like boats, which are old barrows. Uh, like Viking burrows. Uh, normally you can find some treasure and some bones in them. Let's just have a look. Anything else worth picking up? Some more stones. Ah, here we go. So I was like me and about barrow. See, so got two rows of stones. I see it's like a barrow. It's, not, it's like a boat shape, really. Um, and I think you see water down there as well. With the right tool you can dig in here and uh, find treasure. I'm just going to head down this way because I think I can see water. Yes I can. Okay so not far from water. So here, somewhere around here might be quite a good place to build. What's over this way? Some more strawberries, sorry, raspberries. Pick them when you see them if you can. They grow back as long as you don't destroy the bushes. And be aware that falling trees will destroy them. That was a deer. You can see up oh, there it is. Now you see me. Nope, hasn't now. He's lost me now. If I'm good enough, you can sneak up behind deer. I think he's seen me. That's what that. Oh no, he hasn't. And oh, I've got him. Right. I want to see what was over here anyway. Um. I just want to show you that, that you can creep up on animals. Oh, where's a grayling? Why do we get grayling in the ball at the same time? I've got both of them anyway. Here's one of the rune stones. So if you look at it, it'll come up in uh, Viking runes and it'll come up in English. This land is hard and wild, but we who are brought here are harder still. Take comfort, traveller and the gifts before you, the good wood, the stone, the fruits and flowers of the forest. Look also to the wild boar who roam these lands. They fear fire and the hand of man, but they can be tough to obey it. Go quickly to them and let them eat of your stock. Roots of the ground are their pleasure. Yeah, whatever that means. Basically, hunt the boars. Um. No, oh, I don't like that, but over there, a bit too broken up the land. I prefer it over this way a bit. No more raspberries. So I think, looking at this land, I'm going to probably just build somewhere around here, so I'm not too far from the water. Better starting locations, put it that way. There's a building down here. Let's have a quick look. Oh, there's a couple, a couple of buildings down here, more strawberries. They don't go off, thankfully. It's always worth picking them up. 
I'm wasting daylight because I, I need to get to a shelter build up. There's another building over there, is there? Oh. Where is he? I can hear you. Come on. Out the woods. Thank you. Anything in here worth taking? I can't see. Maybe there was a dump. A village or something here to begin with. There's a door there. Nothing behind me. No chests or anything now. Let's have a quick look in this one. This actually looks, if I clear these trees out, this actually looks quite a good place to build. And I know it's all, it's like, oh my god, there's a load of trees there, but they'll clear these out fairly quickly. That's that. Where was that other building? I thought I saw another building in the woods over here. That was a chest in this one, good. What we got in there? So we got some amber, some coins, and a torch. Take all those, thank you very much. They will come in handy. Um, yeah, this actually looks quite a good place to build. I think this is where I'm going to build, guys. I think I'm going to start building here. There's plenty of raspberries around. There's plenty of wood around for material. And um, just over there is a plains bit. So, yep, yeah, this is where I'm going to build. So... Let's start building. We're going to have to start clearing some of this space out. So, um. Oh, nope, I need to build myself an axe. We'll go there. And a hammer. Alright, I was waiting for a matey boy to show his face. And now we're going to get a whole list of things I can build. Oh, and there's a grayling over there, I can see him. I can't get to you too high in the rocket, do you? You have crafted a hammer. With this tool, you will raise mighty halls and thorough fortifications. Start by building a workbench. This, in turn, will enable you to construct other things. Yup, I know that. Oh, there's a deer over there, not a... No, there is a grating over here somewhere. Nope, let's not, let's not worry about that for now. Let, let's start with uh, chopping down some trees and clearing some space. And obviously every time you use a tool, you gain a bit of experience with it. And it also uses your stamina. You can see at the bottom. Oh, get it away from three. Oh, fall on you to kill you. Oh, can't kill you. And then when they die, they explode and give you bits. Oh, that's another one. Where's the other one? Come on then. Come and meet Colin. Say hello to Colin the Club. Come back here, you wimp. Uh, chicken. Right. Is it going back? No. Let's go chop a tree up. So yeah, you've got to be careful of falling trees and falling, even the logs can roll and uh, kill you if you're not careful. And they can damage other trees. In early games it's actually possible to get trees to fall on the birch trees. and. Um, destroy them for you. But it's not easy. Right, let's get some wood. Let's so get a full retreat. Where is he? Come on. I knew you'd come back. Okay. 
Right, what am I out of? You. You can get rid of tree stumps as well. You don't have to. You don't really get a lot for them. They take a lot of effort. But I'm only doing it because I want to build around here. Um, and I think I'm going to take this building down. Oop! Get rid of all these things around here. So I just roll it. Actually, can I build my workbench and get rid of that? Let's clear that. Right, to put your to build, you put your hammer in your hand and right click. And what I want to build is um, a crafting bench. Let's quickly build that. That red line you can see. Here we go. You have built a workbench. I know I have. You told me to. A workbench allows you to craft complex items as well as giving access to lots of more building pieces to construct with the hammer. Yeah, that's all you can see the things flashing up there, all the things I can now build. Yeah, goodbye, go away. Right. Um. I'm just wondering if I can destroy this. Ah, uh, yeah, because this is by my craft bench now. I can actually destroy this. And I can recover the wood. So, just a quick way of uh, getting some bits back. That would otherwise have been lost and to destroy things. The uh, most, the scroll wheel, the most button three. So you just click with that. They're destroyed because there's nothing holding them up. So just collapsing. I think that's pretty much everything around here. But yeah. So let's do a bit more clearing. Can I build a hoe yet? Ah, needs a roof. Okay. Um, let's just keep clearing this area a bit. We're gonna go. Ah, oh, it's a beach tree. Oh yeah, that's right, beach chair. Yeah. Where are you going? Ah, uh, my workbench! This could be a bit dangerous. Where are you going? You're going that way as well. Alright. This... Hey! That was my fire at hit. Wood. Let's keep the fire going there. Let's get rid of these tree stumps. Yeah. My axe is broken. Right, let's... Um, Where is he? I can hear you, come on. And I can see you as well, I can hear you and see you. Be wary of the weather. When the temperature drops at night, or if you're wet, you will suffer from being cold. This reduces your stamina regeneration. Seek shelter by an open flame. This is your best option when this happens. You need to learn to enunciate more clearly. Ok, 
can hear something. Is that him again? No? Okay. Right, base, base, base. I want to build my base. And I kind of want it... Um, here. To the start. Stop sitting away. This is literally just going to be tiny wee little base to begin with. It's up blocked by ah, blocked by you, isn't it? Okay, let's um. Build another workbench, but build it up here. He needs to be under cover, so wall. What is causing that shaking? Hmm, that's a little bit worrying. <laughs> Get the wall the right way around. You can go there. You can go there. Don't run over my fire because it hurts you. I can dismantle you. Sorry guys, I know you can't really see much here, I'm just trying to get a bit of a, a bit of cover over my workbench. Now is that enough? Ah, oh, it's still too exposed, damn it. Okay, um So a bit of light in the scene so you can see what's going on. Well, I missed that wall, didn't I? It's a problem trying to build in the dark. Right, it's still too exposed. No, there we go. That's better. So I can repair my axe now. Right. Let's get rid of the stump. Sorry, get rid of the stump, not my base. There we go. That's done. Get rid of you. Come on. God, that one doesn't want to go, does it? Um, I need to eat some more food. Oh. Alright, sneak up on me, didn't you, eh? That didn't work. Alright, eat some food. <laughs> this time. Yeah, you can be careful as logs rolling towards you as well. They can um, badly hurt you. I know this all looks a bit cramped at the moment, but I'll get this all opened out by taking down all these logs and trees, and I'll be able to build quite a sized base here. And I'm close enough to the water uh, that I can build out to make a dock and things. 
What am I end up doing? Just building a huge moat around my base. That's full of wood. Right, I need to start placing some um, foundations. Build a hoe. So let's start leveling some of this ground. Feel cold, yeah, better do. It's a shame that stone's there. Um. You're not going to snap, are you? No. Can you snap under there? No. Come on, just snap for me. No. Okay. Build my base out along this way a little bit. Uh, that way. Sorry guys, I'm just trying to, uh, yeah, you can't see much here. I'm just trying to get some posts underneath my base. Right. Walls. I built down the wrong base. Okay, I've misaligned that, so that needs to come down. And it's a new day. That doesn't look... That right. No, it doesn't quite look right, that, but obviously it is.
I want to go for the less steep roof, that one. Like so. Okay, let's just carry on building this. Quick base just to get it going. Let us say. Nothing flash. Get the half one on there, will I? Alright, there we go. Let's help support the roof. And you can come down. And you can come down. Got the wood up, and now I hopefully be able to build a bed. Now, where is the ground closest to my base? Ideally, I want. Oh, go away, go away. Go away. wood and yeah, see if that's high enough for me what's that one path stone I need stone to raise a right let's go get some stone Where are you? I can hear you, but I can't see you. There you are. You have crafted a hoe. This tool is used for landscaping. You could say it's a perfect complement to the hammer. Use it to clear the ground and manipulate the terrain. It is easier to create buildings on level ground. Yep, I know. But I need some stones. Oh, it was, uh, beach has normally stones over here, here we go. Oh, some flint, I'll take that. Now I can build a flint axe now, that's a better axe, which I will do. Once I get enough flint, I'm going to get doing fairly well here. Um, Come on, Colin wants to talk to you. <coughs> Don't mess with Colin. That's Colin the club to you. More flint. Ah. Deer over there. We do need their hide, so I'm going to try and sneak up on him. If I can. Which way is the wind blowing? Oh. Ah, he saw me. He saw me, not to worry. I think I've read this one, haven't I? Sisters and brothers of the shield, wall, lift up your hearts. You're the greatest warriors chosen by the All Father himself for your courage and valour. Now death has brought you to the land where you can remake yourself in battle and toil, winning favour and honour from the gods. Leave your memories to rot in Midgard along with your sins. The finest part of you is here. Okay. Still need stones. Okay, I've got plenty of flint, but I, I need some stones. Ok, 
Okay, 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 come on, stone somewhere, God, there must be stone somewhere. I can hear you. anywhere there's some stones yes yes I know you're over there somewhere I've seen such a lack of stones in my life oh here we go next for dinner and some grayling. Come here. Shame you can't eat those graylings, there's plenty of them about. Right, chill while I'm here. Here. And now I need to flatten it a bit. No, it's still raising it. Um. that look inside? Have I rated too much? A uh, little bit maybe. about it. The reason I'm doing this is I want to build a fire pit. Build a fire pit. Yeah, look at that. Oh, 
and that will keep the rain off. So now I can build crafting that one. You, you can go there and you can go there. Get some better food on the go. Building it, so I'm just uh, cooking all the meat I've got. cooked meat, we can, what's that one give us, tap fence, I'm now 30 health, uh, the cut neck tails, where are they, 8 stamina, so we'll eat one of these, I've got a pillar down there, get a pillar there, got this side, yeah, I've got a pillar there, You're there, you're okay. You're there, there. I can't get you to snap. In position. I didn't want to do that. I do find it annoying he's going to snap into position. Okay, we can do that, and then maybe that. Missing requirement. Okay, so missing wood. So I need to go and chop up the rest of these logs. Where are they? I know some of these are raspberry bushes, but there's plenty around here. That's from the clear out area. Well, this bait is going to grow a whole lot more. How do I repair again? Okay, is there another one? Yeah, I thought I heard another one. Come here! Got you. Right, let's go make that flint axe and I also want the bed. So Furniture, bed. Put of the bed close to the fire. 
so you can go there. I now need you, actually you can go here. So that's an upgrade for my workbench. Um, furniture, chest. I'll stick one of you over, a couple of you over here. One, two, I'm going to build one. Okay, what do you want? I know you're going to tell me there's a bed. A headrest for the weary. Sleep the night away in your bed and awake the feeling refreshed and full of energy. Another improvement to your home would be some chests where you can store items. You've done it, mate. It's good practice to always have some spare equipment if something unfortunate should happen to you while you're exploring. Yeah, don't I know it. So. First things first. Oh, I can't build a flint axe. What am I missing? Flint axe, flint axe. Oh, can't build a flint axe, there we go. Craft that. And then you can go into there. You can go there. Don't need you. Don't need you. Don't need you at the moment. Certainly don't need you. Um, don't really need you on me. I'll keep you because I could use a leather later. And the same with you. Keep my food down the bottom as my cooked meats. Oh, I've got cooked venison as well, I forgot about that. Nope, why aren't you stacking with him? There we go. And I don't need those that coin on me. Over there. Over there. Don't need two torches. So let's have some cooked venison. And which is the best one for stamina? 15, 20, and a strawberry. Raspberry. I'm probably going to have to move that in a minute. Uh, what else can I build now? So obviously by putting that on, I've upgraded my workbench. Which means I can now build leather tunics instead of just rags. So for a leather tunic, I need six hides. What do I need for a crude bow? Ten wood and eight leather scraps. But as it's coming up tonight, and the end of the second second in-game day, maybe the third, um, I think it's time I should uh, leave it there. Like I say, this is the start of a playthrough of uh, Valhalla. Valhalla. <laughs> Valheim. Ashlands, we have a small little base where we can sleep and build things, which is a good start. Um, and we will expand from there. So thanks for watching guys. Please hit the like and subscribe. There is a there is a join button below if you'd like to join my channel. And Dragonfly Gamer wishing you good night.